Hello, hello. We are now currently live on both our Facebook Live and Zoom platforms. Good evening, good evening to each of you all who are joining in with us on our various platforms, so it's on Zoom. And those that are coming in on our Facebook Live feed, let me lower this music down just a little. Let me see if I can pick up. Come on in, come on in. We are here, we are live on this leap day. Praise the Lord. Come on in as we resume our lesson from last week as we deal with essential for changing the world. Yes. Of course, we talked about enlisting others. Today we're going to deal with uh, expect problems. Of course, it's because we've been called to a certain area. That means everything will go all easily. Good evening, Mary Ann Westchester. Good evening, good evening Kamiko Stevenson and evening, good family. Evening. For those come of you on who in. are in on Zoom and on our Facebook Don't Live, Marie, we come, come on in. in. Come on in. Like, comment, and share as you're coming in. Kamika Stevenson and the Stevenson family. Marcia Brother Jermaine. Marcia Williams. Come on in. Maxine Lawless, come on God in, bless come on Maxine in. Maxine Lawless from Leeds City, yes. Texas. Sharon Nicholas has sister checked Liz, in. Sister Nicholas sister is in Nicholas the house, all right? Come on, Sister you. Nicholas. Checked in, tapped in. Pray all is well. Pray that, that you are recovering on and the men. being restored. Sherry Dennis has checked in. Tiwiti has checked God in. God bless you, come Sister Sherry uh, Dennis and uh, Tiwiti. God bless you. Yeah, come on in. Like, comment, and share as you're coming in. Bertha Joshua, come Bertha, on in. God bless Blessings you, Bertha. To you. Sister Bertha, God bless you. T. Liz has checked in. Come on in, come on in. Mother has checked in on Zoom. All about Zoom participant. God bless you. Sister Sis Myra, Sister Sis Myra, Bernie, better than blessed. And someone has a tablet. Yeah, y'all come on in, come on in. Glad to see you all in on this evening. Like, comment, and share as you're coming in. To those on Facebook, of course. <laughs> come on in, come on in. Take a seat. Take your, uh, get your favorite uh, drink. And let's have uh, a table talk. Alcohol, let's not talk. alcoholic. Let's have a talk. <laughs> Sister Betty Thomas, God bless you. Brother Ryan August, God bless you. Liz, uh, T. Liz, God, God bless you. T. Liz Nelson is in. Hi, Sister Betty Thomas. And Sister Brother Connie Ryan and is family. on Sister our. Sister Connie, let's give it to Facebook Live. Facebook Live, God bless you, Sister Connie. Good blessed evening to you, Sister Connie. Good evening, 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 Sister Connie. Good Lesson 14, part two, continuation from last week's lesson. We are still on this journey to changing the world. And we've been diving into some lessons, giving us some nuggets with regards to what things we are to be doing if we want to effect change. And that change begins with us. That's one of the key components, key things that we've learned throughout this journey is that the change begins with us before we can then go out and effect change. And when we're talking about change, we're talking about godly change. A change to working to walk in your purpose. Sister De Stella Jones, God bless you, sister. That's uh, Stella uh, Jones. Alana Lois Verrett Williams. Yes, her surgery has been, been postponed until the 18th. So we continue right. to uh, lift you up in prayer. Yes. yes. Pastor Baptiste, come on in. Pastor Baptiste. Uh, Desiree Tim, you come on in. Good evening. Sister Denise uh, Sanders. Denise Sanders, come on in, come on in. We have Cynthia Dunn. Cent has checked in. All right, God bless you, Sister Dunn and Brother Dunn. Charles Peace has Dunn. checked in. Joanne Jones. Hey, Joanne. 
Look like uh, Grace is trying to come in. <laughs> Grace is in. Uh, Sis Melissa has checked in. Okay, good evening, Sister Melissa. And Melissa family. Is in. Y'all come on in, like, comment, and share as you're coming in. Like, comment, and share as you're coming in. Reverend Raymond Collins and Juanita Collins has checked in, and they are evangelizing. God bless you, um, Reverend, um, Reverend Collins, Deaconess uh, Collins. Or is God it that he's saying they're in her, their midst? That okay. is to be Elder Rush, Mother Collins. All right. Uh, Debbie. Elder is in the house. God bless you, Elder. All right. God bless you, you Sister Collins and Debbie, uh, of course. And pray yes. all is well. Praise the Lord. Evangelist has checked Evangelist in. Evangelist is, yes. is in the house. All yeah, right. we're sporting green today for the leap year. Fro we we've broken it out tonight. Hallelujah. <laughs> Somebody gets a birthday every four years. And so today, mm -hmm. the, uh, March the 29th, as we leaping, I mean, uh, yeah, they're right. uh, as we <laughs> go into from February 29th to March, yes. we are moving into March we're gladness. Leaping, we're, leaping we're leaping into in. March yes. gladness. I make sure I get that right. Um, of course, this is the leap year. Uh, anyone born on February 29th, they get a birthday every four years. Uh, come on in, come on in. Uh, celebrate the first of the month, I'll be in, however yes. they choose. So That's good. Remember Melba? Reverend, Brown Oob, your cousin has right, checked in. Brown <laughs> Oob, make and Reverend Michael, if you're nearby, come on you. in. Bless you. Bless you. Good evening. Like, comment, and share as you're coming in. Come on in. Come God on bless in. Sisters, uh, Grace has Reverend checked Oob in. And the Oobs, of course. <laughs> uh, powerful pastor, uh, Minister Oob, and of course, the husband. I know that uh, tag team. <laughs> all right, all right. Brother Kurt Jones has checked in. Come on in. Good evening Kurt to Jones. you. Kurt Jones. God bless you, Brother Kurt Jones. Jory uh, um, Duncans. God bless you. Yolanda Peters. Hey, Lonnie. My homegirl. <laughs> I mean, Peters. Mark. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and she, She's my homegirl. I know. <laughs> Dolores Ivy. Come on in. Did Hope you, you are well. Did you recognize uh, Malik? Malik and Mal, uh, uh, Mal Manisha and Malik got to see them this weekend. Big boy. Yeah. Y'all come on in, like, comment, and share as you're coming in. We're going to be getting started shortly, but of course, as we indicated, uh, we're still in chapter 16. 16. This is part two of last week's lesson. It was so much information to provide, and we didn't want to just stuff y'all with it, so we kind of split Praise it in half. And we're going to roll out part two of that same lesson. Essentials for changing the world. The essentials changing. for changing the world. And I know one of the things that the pastor is going to kind of just bring us up to speed. So I don't want to Go ahead step on, on his it, parade. You, you know, but, you uh, you know we Go just got to make sure uh, that we're in lockstep with the word of God as we are on this journey. As he has commissioned, out, commissioned us to go ye out. We want to make sure that we're doing our part to prepare ourselves. Don't take it lightly. Don't do things haphazardly. But we're going in the spirit of God across the spectrum as we are navigating this Christian journey. So if you want to get your Bibles and devices together, we're coming out of Acts 16 chapter. Of course, we've been on the journey in the Acts of the Apostle as we have been striving to be world changers. And as we oftentimes ask, have you all been doing your part have you all been doing the work to effect change? Praise the Lord. And we're, we're, we're dealing with Acts, of course, and we've been there, been here for a while. But uh, when we read our Bible from the Gospel, Matthew, Mark, Luke, mm -hmm. and John, of course, um, Acts is now the continuation, the work uh, that Christ began. He now continue in the church. Of course, the church is born on Pentecost. Yes. And now we begin to start seeing the widespread of the church as the church begin to, mm -hmm. to move. Now, yeah. Paul is getting ready to go, or he's on European soil. Of course, God has called him, and of course, in order for him to fulfill that, he has to enlist mm -hmm. other people. Amen. Uh, we can't do it by ourselves. No. Two are better than one. Then one. If one Amen. fall, the other are there. To and lift so them up. Work, to hold them the accountable. Work. All of those things. Sis Ortiz. Good blessed evening to you. I think you've covered a jewelry and how uh, 
Jura Duncan, come on in. And of course, we have uh, Sis Bell joining us on tonight. Good evening. Sis Bell. We have uh, Sis Joanna Jones God and bless sisters. You, Sister Joanna Jones. Take our little sip. God bless come on you. In. God bless you. <laughs> Y'all yeah, come on in, like, comment, and share since Irma Rodney has checked in. And guess who else is joining us? Hallelujah. Uh-oh. Passion? No, Malik is evangelizing. Malik, Malik. He has his little cousin Marley. Hey, Marley. <laughs> Marley is, is, is watching us tonight as well. All right, all right, Malik. Do your do your do your do. Malik is evangelizing. Hello, little Marley. Y'all come on in. If y'all want to get your Bibles and devices again um, together before we really get started, we're coming out of Exodus 16 chapter for those who are just joining us. We're going to pick up at verse 12. We're going to pick up at the we'll verse 12 and we're just 12. going to I'm go. kind of walk through it and try to get leaders. as much as we possibly can. But we just want you to know that, you know, our, our lesson again is a continuation of journey into changing a world. And so we're dealing with some things that we need, some tools mm -hmm. or some things that we need in order to, to be able to achieve that. And so uh, last week we talked about enlisting other people. Uh, with it, of course, and um, it takes a man, it takes a collaboration, it takes mm -hmm. an effort, it takes a team, and there's no I in team. We all have to do it uh, together. Nobody nobody can do it by themselves. Amen. And there's no long ranger in the kingdom of God. We're a team. Hi, sis Deborah Dennis and sister-in-law Shepro. God bless you. God bless and you. Big brother, if you're nearby. Reverend Kenneth August and family. God bless you. Yes. Yes. Y'all come on in, like, comment, and share as you're coming in. Sister-in-law is in. Is she coming in? Uh, uh, Shalita? Uh, yes, um, Big Sis. This Big Sis has been busy around the yard. Hmm. <laughs> spring is springing, but the snakes coming out too. Well, they might have went back, got a little cold yes. back. We don't know. They don't know whether it's going to be cold or hot. So you got a fireplace on tonight. <laughs> Y'all come on in. Like I mentioned, she was warming up some sticks, in. and of course, and he oh. grabbed it, and uh, that snake came out, and that snake bit him. And that's what she's saying. Good evening in front of the fireplace. Yeah. <laughs> they were waiting for him to die. Southern weather, right? That'll be something next. Year. I'll be coming into that too. Oh, guess who else is joining us on this evening? Oh. Not to leave Manisha out. Oh, she's evangelizing as well. Malana, hi Malana. So Malana and Marley and Manisha and Malik. Okay, Manisha is uh Eminem is doing it now. She's doing the thing tonight. <laughs> Y'all come on in, like, comment, and share as you are coming in. We're gonna get started in a few minutes for those who are just joining us. If you want to get your Bibles and devices together. We're coming out of the Exodus 16 chapter. Tonight will be part two of last week's lesson. Um, and as we oftentimes say, we hope these lessons have really been rewarding and enlightening to you as we have been on this journey to changing the world. The change starts with you and you want to make sure that it's positive change. Amen. Uh, we want to let our light so shine so that men will see our good works and, and want to glorify the Father which is in heaven. So, you know, none of us are perfect. We strive for perfection. We may not always meet, meet the mark. We may not always be um, on point. But as we're having a thirst to want to do better, to want to learn better, to want to grow, do the work. We have to all do the work Amen. to effect change. Be the change Grace is, that you want to see. Grace is in the house. Grace is in the house. Junior is in the house. Junior is in the house. He, Junior is literally in the house. <laughs> <laughs> but he's checking in. I'm not saying. Brother Neighbor has checked in. Uh, brother Neighbor is in the house. Yes. I mean, he's, he's at, at his house, but uh -huh. he's Brother Neighbor. Hallelujah. Across the street. Amen. So with that being said, let me just do this right quick. With that being said, we're going to go ahead and get started. Good, glorious, blessed evening to each and every one of you all 
who have taken time out of your busy schedule to join in with us as you so faithfully do. And we don't take it lightly. We are humbly grateful for your participation as we're diving into the Word of God. We don't want to be about growing uh, by ourselves. We want this to be a team effort. So we are delighted that you choose to join in and grow with us. And as you have been on this journey with us, journey to changing the world, being world changers, doing a part to effect change, really uh, exhibiting the change that you desire to see. Let that reflect through you in your homes, or in your community, on your jobs, wherever the sole of your feet is planted. Be that change you desire to see. And we've been really uh, receiving a lot of little nuggets that has helped us along the way. It has it has really compelled us to do that soul searching, to see where we're falling short. And as I said earlier, none of us are perfect. We're striving for perfection. But we use the word of God to really highlight where it is we're falling short. Really be serious about doing your self-examination to see where it is you need to course correct. Where it is that you're falling short. And where how you are now having the thirst to really rise up as you're learning better to strive to do better. And Amen. again, our title on tonight is, of course, uh, part two, lesson 14, Essentials for Changing the World. We're coming out of Acts, the 16th chapter. Uh, we're going to pick up at verse 12, but I'm going to open up with verse uh, 23 to 25. But before I do that, I kind of jump the gun, of course. We're bringing you greetings on behalf of the Emmanuel Baptist Church, where my dear husband, Reverend Charles R. Brown Sr., is pastor. And we hold true to a mission of really just spreading God's love. And we hope that you're feeling the love. And that is that we love the Lord, we love each other, and we love the lost. We are growing and flowing in love. We are a church that is Christ-centered, Bible-based, and family-focused. And again, we hope that you are feeling love as we try to exude it by way of these platforms. Welcome, and those who are joining us on our Zoom platform, and those of you all who are joining us on our Facebook Live. We're coming out of Acts, the 16th chapter. I'm going to open up with verses 23 through 25, and it reads, And when they had laid many stripes upon him, mm. they cast them into the prison, charging the jailer to keep them safely. Mm. Who, having received such a charge, thrust them into the inner prison and made their feet fast in the stocks. Mm -hmm. Verse 25. And at midnight, Paul and, Silas. Paul and Silas prayed and sang praises unto God. And the prisoners heard them. Um, I've just read Exodus 16 chapter verses 23 to 25. May the Lord add the blessing to the reading, hearing, and the doing of the soul of the word. Again, essentials for changing the world. Essentials for changing the world. Before we dive in, we're going to ask that the pastor opens up And of prayer. course, subtitle for those who want one, Good Trouble. Oh, okay. Good. Hallelujah. Good trouble, of course. Necessary trouble. Uh -huh. Needed trouble. Amen. In order to save the soul of America. Reminder, a remembrance of John Lewis. God, our Father, we love and honor you. We give you glory and praise on this wonderful day, day that you've made. We rejoice and we're so glad in it. God, we thank you, dear God, for your angels yes, as you God. watch over us throughout this day. You protected us, dear God, from danger, yes. seen and unseen. God, we thank you for this precious moment that you've given us on tonight, dear God, as we come, Lord God, to, Lord God, to, to rightly divide oh, your yes, word. We realize you, and recognize, God, that man can't live by prayer alone, alone, but every word that proceeds out, out of the mouth of God. And God, we are your uh, vehicle. Yes, we're your instrument. Yes, we're your God, body, Lord yes. God. To, we're your mouthpiece, yes, Lord God. Jesus. We pray now yes, that, Lord. dear God, that you would speak to us through us and Hallelujah, cause anoint us afresh, God, that as we would speak and as we teach today, Lord God, we would do it in the oracles Hallelujah, of God. Jesus. And as we minister, we pray that, yes, God, God, you are truly glorified, bless every ear, anoint every ear, every heart, Lord God, every ears are attentive and every heart is receptive. 
Now, God, we lift yes, this Jesus. word up to you. We pray that it will go forward and yes. go out. You said it was not, you it will not return void, but you said it will accomplish which well please you. It will prosper wherever you yes. send it. So, God, we pray tonight that it will fall on good, good soil, soil, that it will produce a harvest 30, 60, and 100 fold. And God, we are so mindful to give you all the praise, all the glory, and the honor. We ask it all in the name of the Father, the Son, and of the precious Holy Spirit, we pray. Amen. Amen, amen, amen. The essentials to changing the world. Praise the Lord. Again, we are in the book of Acts, and Acts of the Apostles, Acts of uh, the Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. Acts of mainly Peter and, of course, uh, Paul. Peter, of course, has been given a task to preach to the Jews, yeah. of course, and Paul to the Gentile. Paul now is moving toward his second mm -hmm. uh, missionary journey. journey. It's amazing that with all of the uh, resources that we have mm -hmm. and all of the available technology we have, we don't even have to leave our house Come into on. And uh, to reach the world, yeah. but those uh, those disciples mm -hmm. and apostles, they went out and they they did the work. They they yeah. were moving and they were bringing about change, of moving course, change. within the world. And yeah. of course, on last week we talked about essential for changing mm -hmm. uh, the world. Of course, as we remember, Paul had got the vision, but when Paul got the vision, Paul wrote the vision down, and of course he enlisted yeah. other people mm -hmm. because, of course, in order for uh, us to be able to bring about change, yeah. it's going to take an effort, it's going to take a Collective, team. Yeah. And we talked about yeah. team. Teamwork makes uh, yeah. the dream work. There's no I in team. Mm -hmm. There's no long ranger. Uh, we need others. Of course, when Jesus sent his disciple out, he didn't send them out by themselves, but he sent them out two yeah. by two. two. So, mm -hmm. uh, 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 of course, now Paul and Paul and the uh, uh, his team mm -hmm. now is in uh, Macedonia. They hear the cry. They hear uh, uh, for help. Mm -hmm. And so we talked about uh, uh, not only uh, uh, enlist people, yeah. but when God called us mm -hmm. to do a work or uh, do an assignment, then we have to expect problems. Yeah, come on. And of course, on the <laughs> forefront, uh, we don't hear that because all we hear is when we receive the call and we, we're ready to do the work yeah. and we and think that well. automatically mm -hmm. that everything is going to be, be peaches mm -hmm. and cream. Yeah. We think that it's going to just be all mm -hmm. smooth sailing. Mm -hmm. We don't, we think that, that we're never ever going to do anything, yeah. but we got to know problems. that when you are mm -hmm. going to do the yeah. will of God yeah. and the work of God, it it's going to be confronted. Yeah. Uh, Satan is going to do something, but always know that no matter what, God is sovereign. Yes. And if you stay in the will of God, mm -hmm. God grace will keep you and sustain you oh, and God yes. will fulfill whatever it is that he has called you to do. You got to trust God no matter what no matter uh, your what. situation is. And so Paul and him now is in Macedonia. Mm -hmm. And we're going to pick up at verse number 13. And they're there literally because uh, they hear a cry for help. And they and Paul sees a man, but watch who God opened up. Watch how this started. How it started off not with a man, but it started off with women. Amen, amen, amen. Again, that's Acts the 16th chapter, verse 13. And on the Sabbath, we went out of the city by a riverside, where prayer was wont to be made, and we sat down and spake unto the women, which resorted. So Paul and now is in, uh, 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 they're in Macedonia. Mm -hmm. Philippian is the chief city of this particular area. And so when they're there, mm -hmm. uh, 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 because uh, they didn't have 10 Jews, they didn't have a synagogue. So you see how uh, uh, even in this particular uh, uh, area, they didn't have a church. So what they did was they went by by the riverside mm. and while by the riverside mm -hmm. what they did they began to pray of course verse 12 said well there are many days so even being there we gotta always know that when god called us to do mm -hmm. a work and when he called us to do an assignment just don't think that it gonna happen right away yeah and so and don't think that okay when he called me mm -hmm. into assignment mm -hmm. that everything is already set up mm -hmm. i got a synagogue but the they didn't have no synagogues mm -hmm. they didn't have, they had to be patient mm -hmm. and they had to put in the work right 
And a lot of times people think that, you know, uh, when I'm dealing with ministry and talking about evangelism or evangelizing mm -hmm. and bringing about a change, we don't, you don't realize that you got you to gotta be willing to put in the work. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You got to be willing to put in the work. Mm -hmm. And even while I put in the work, whenever you plant seed, guess what? That um, uh, whenever agriculture turns, mm -hmm. that former plant, that seed, then he don't just automatically get a harvest. He's mm -hmm. expecting a harvest. Yeah. He's expecting the increase. But in order for him to get that increase, he has to put in the work. Amen. And you have to put in the work by any means necessary. We hmm. got, it's time out for making excuses about why we can't. If God has called us and equipped us to go forward and do so, we're going to make concessions. We're going to do what we need to do. Look, they were by the riverside. Guess what? That didn't stop them from singing. Praise the Lord. That didn't stop them from praying. They're, we're the church, and so we will affect God's presence, God's work, God's praise, God's worship, wherever we are. Mm -hmm. No need to make excuses. Mm. Put in the work, put in the work, of course. Uh, not a church, but they're by mm -hmm. the riverside. Mm -hmm. Verse 14. And a certain woman named Lydia, a seller of purple, of the city of Tar Tartira, which worshiped God, heard us, whose heart the Lord opened, that she attended unto the things which were spoken of Paul. So, so, so Lydia was uh, a, a believer, but mm -hmm. she wasn't a Christian. Of course, uh, uh, she's a seller of purpose. She's mm -hmm. a businesswoman. Yes. Uh, she, 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 she's uh, not from Philadelphia, Philippian, but she's from Tartaria. Of course, and God opened, she's a worshiper of God. Mm -hmm. God opened up her heart, heart and she attended the word that was spoken by the Apostle Paul. Of course, the Bible says that whosoever call on the name of the Lord shall be saved. Of course, it says, how can they call whom they never believe? How can they believe what they never heard? How can they hear without a preacher? How can he preach except it be what? How beautiful are the feats of him who preach the gospel of peace, a glad tidings of good thing. For all have not believed our report. Faith come by what? Hearing. And hearing by. And so if they are going to get yeah. saved, they got to preach the gospel. Yes. Of course, so Paul is preaching the gospel, and when Paul preached the gospel, guess who opened her heart? Mm. The Bible says God yes. opened her heart. Her heart. Yes. She received the things of God. And watch what happened in verse 15. And verse 15, and when she was baptized, there she go. in her household, she besought us, saying, if ye have judged me to be faithful to the Lord, Come into my house and abide there, and she constrained it us. So here they are, Paul and them, they're getting ready to start. Mm -hmm. God has called them that they got the, that they the, the, the helping in, in this European yeah. nation. Uh, uh, Lydia is there. He opened her heart, mm -hmm. heart, and she not only opened her heart, she shows evidence that she's saved yes. because she's baptized. Mm -hmm. Baptized is an outward witness of an inward working yes. of the Holy Spirit. Is showing that I am a follower of Jesus Christ mm -hmm. through His death through his burial, and, and through his resurrection. So she gives a witness mm. that she has been receiving Christ. And, and not only household. that, she opened her house. Yeah. She opened up her heart. Mm. Not only that, she opened up her, uh, 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 her household. Mm. And of course, while he was there, not only she got saved, mm. but her household, household got saved. Yeah. And she constrained the them yeah. to stay there. She constrained them to stay in to fellowship. Constrain, them, yeah. yeah, she wanted them to stay there mm -hmm. uh, 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 as they were teaching them the word of God. Amen. So being baptized, mm -hmm. of course, we missed the second part. The Bible says in, in, in Matthew 28 and uh, uh, 20, go ye into all nations. Mm -hmm. Bap uh, teaching all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and of the Holy Spirit and teaching them. So That's he taught them, place. but then we have to get back to that place where mm -hmm. we have to disciple them. Yes. She constrained them mm -hmm. to stay there. Mm -hmm. Verse she, she, because she had a thirst to want to Praise know the Lord. She had a thirst to want to know. She no more. And so she had a thirst to do that and she invited them into her home. And it came to pass as we went to prayer a certain denzel possessed with the spirit of divination, met us, which brought her masters much grain by suit saying. So now watch, they're still Paul and they're constantly doing the work. Mm -hmm. They're constantly doing the work. Yeah. And we're talking about expect problem. Mm -hmm. And expect problem to show up. Yeah. And guess where the problem, the problem will show up? Mm -hmm. The problem will show up right 
where they're at in prayer. Yeah. A lot of times when we're doing the in will worship. of God, yeah. when we're doing what God called us to do, mm -hmm. the enemy will try, he'll oh, show he'll up in one up. way yeah. or another. Yeah. And that's why we have to, as believers, have to make sure that mm -hmm. we are prayed up. Mm -hmm. And that's why I need to make sure that not only we'll pray it up, but we have to pray one for it another. Because the enemy already see now, wait a minute, mm -hmm. they're coming. Yeah. And the gospel now is yeah. bringing Bible change. Study, yeah. Because we are seeing the change that happened in Lydia House, and now they're constantly going to this mm. uh, 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 by the riverside, yeah. and they're constantly oh, praying. They're praying. And so all they of a worship, sudden, now here praising. comes a woman mm -hmm. whose possessed was a spirit of a divination, yeah, Python. Yeah. She she has a she she she's she's a fortune teller, mm -hmm. and uh, 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 she's really has been hired mm -hmm. and bringing a lot of money, money. in yeah. uh, through her Follow her suicide. Yes. Uh, 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 of course, watch what happened. Go verse sixteen. Verse seventeen. The same follow Paul and us in Christ, saying, "These men are the servants of the Most High God." Will shew unto us the way of salvation. So now watch what happened. And I've I seen this. I said, Lord, well, uh, they're following Paul. Mm -hmm. and, 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 she, and they follow Paul uh -huh. uh, uh, and his servant. And they were doing it. And they followed him many days. And, and she literally said what Paul and them came there to do. Mm -hmm. Notice she said, these men of serving of the Most mm -hmm. High God. That was true. Mm -hmm. And they came to she show us the way were. of salvation. <laughs> the enemy know exactly what it is yes. we came to do. So what was wrong with that? Mm -hmm. What actually was wrong with that mm -hmm. is because a lot of times we have to be mindful who it is that that that, that put their mouth on us. Yeah. We have to be uh -oh. mindful who it is that that literally exalt us yeah. and lift us up. Yeah. Because you Come know on. what's the sad, the mm -hmm. bad evidence is? <laughs> they're talking about how we're showing the salvation yeah. and how we're so anointed, and yet they're still on dry, uh, drug. Mm -hmm. They're still on alcohol. Mm -hmm. They're still yeah. they're not being delivered. And so mess. what it is, it, it becomes a uh, it dilute the message yeah. of God because if I, if I have the power of God mm -hmm. and you're not showing evidence that you're being delivered, mm -hmm. Paul said, wait a minute, I can't allow Something. you mm -hmm. to do that because now you're only saying the gospel don't have power mm -hmm. to bring about a change. Go, read, read the next verse. My God. And so verse 18, and this, and this did she many days, but Paul being grieved, turned and said to the spirit, I command thee in the name of Jesus Christ to come out of her. And he came out the same hour. So, so Paul noticed and recognized yes. who it was behind it. Uh -huh. Paul said, I already know the enemy was coming in literally already to try knows. to dilute it. Yes. And so before mm -hmm. I allow it to go any further, mm -hmm. Paul rebuked it and commanded the spirit to come out of her. Mm -hmm. And the Bible says at that particular hour, yeah. she was delivered. Mm -hmm. She was delivered. Watch what happened. Verse 19. And verse 19, and when her master saw that the hope of their gains was gone. Hmm. They caught Paul and Silas and drew them into the marketplace unto the rulers. So so why was happened? upset? It was so now mad. the first deliverance big man. God mm -hmm. opened the heart yeah. of Lydia. Mm -hmm. And Lydia opened up her house. Yeah. This second deliverance. Come on. Guess what? Uh -huh. God getting ready to open up a prison. Oh. Instead of Paul going mm -hmm. uh, 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 to, and celebrate uh, because this woman mm -hmm. being delivered. Mm -hmm. But what happened was the master saw that their hope was, uh, of gain was gone. Uh -huh. Uh, when, we, when we start to bring changes in our community, oh, when we begin God. to start standing up yeah. and, and, uh, uh, about the alcoholics, yeah. well, um, the alcohol in our community, mm -hmm. about the drugs Drug, in our community, the then guess what? All yeah. of a sudden now, there are folk going to try yeah. to do whatever they can mm -hmm. to stop us, yeah. to shut us up. Mm -hmm. Because if you do that, then then, then the, I will hope pockets. again. Yeah, you're and, and I remember mm -hmm. a long time ago, and I the was love of money. Praise the Lord. The and, and, and so everybody ain't gonna celebrate no. uh, the delivery yeah. because when folk getting delivered, now all of a sudden I can't sell my cigarettes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, cigarettes. I can't sell my. I can't sell my lottery tickets. Mm -hmm. And I so when when, when people get overhaul. free, mm -hmm. I remember uh, 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 we was in the project, Sister Cheryl, and 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 we was in the project, and me and my brother, we had to tour uh, tour 
chores of, of, of bringing the clothes to the laundromat. I know you're looking at me saying, okay, what's going to be this one? <laughs> and uh, we had the chores of bringing the, and so we used to bring the, uh, we had to just go and dry the clothes. And I remember we used to get a dollar, four quarters, and you know how we, we didn't have much. So we made sure we brought the clothes home most of the time wet because we were trying to keep some of the quarters. But when we finally got a dryer, I, couldn't re I, I remember we were telling the owner of the dryer, my mama got her own washer and dryer. It wasn't happen at all. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, you, you, y'all got, that mm -hmm. means if y'all got your, I'm not going to build up, I'm not going to prop it off yeah. of y'all. Mm -hmm. So it's people uh, will to keep us in the plane yeah. and bondage, keep us in the plane. Yeah. Because if you're in bondage, that means you got to depend on me. Mm -hmm. But when I'm depending on God, Come when on. God begin to bless me, <laughs> when God begin to raise me up, everybody is not going to celebrate Amen. that. And so what happened here, we got to stop this gospel. Mm -hmm. Because if they do that, then all of our hope uh, is gained, is going to be lost. And it's during that time when you, as being a, a newly delivered, you have to stay in your ground. Even when others may not celebrate you, even Praise when them. they're going to come against you, even when they're going to rise against you. You know that in Christ, you are a new creature. All things are passed away. All things become new. And God will give you the strength to stand up. To Praise withstand them. anything that's going to come against you. He said no weapon form. They're going to form. They just won't prosper. But you got to you gotta remain faithful and true to what it is you have, you know, as you have started the journey into living for Christ. Praise you're going to have issues. You're not exempt from issues. You're not exempt from trouble. But you're going to be persecuted for God's sake. And that's the type of persecution that you want to be in lockstep. And that's why Jesus taught his disciples the beatitudes, mm -hmm. the attitudes to, yeah. to, to be. Mm -hmm. Of course, he says, we're going to go through persecution. Mm -hmm. uh, of course, but make sure you're being persecuted for mm -hmm. righteousness. righteousness for yes. there is your kingdom, kingdom of God, yes. the kingdom, the kingdom, mm -hmm. the dominion authority uh, to govern the yes. earth, the change of life that mm -hmm. first of all, begin with us and begin mm -hmm. with ourselves. And so our persecution, uh, God used the problems that we have because mm -hmm. we expect it. Yeah. We can get excited about it because we already know that when I'm being persecuted for righteousness, for righteousness, I know yeah. it's not only evidence of yeah. who I am, but it's evidence that a change is getting ready to come. How and the good. enemy has to fight yeah. because he's trying oh. to do whatever he could to try to stop the change yeah. from coming. Of course, the, the majesty took Paul and they literally mm -hmm. uh, 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 they brought them literally to trial. They they, they, they dragged them mm -hmm. uh, uh, in, the, in, a, in a city saying these men trouble the city. Mm -hmm. So what trouble they did? Mm -hmm. The only thing they did was got a woman delivered who was being controlled yeah. by demons. Yeah. Amen, amen. And they saw it as being trouble. Praise the Lord. And how many times change the narrative? How many times we're being mm -hmm. accused? Yeah. Falsely uh, accused. Uh, of falsely accused mm -hmm. of doing the will of God. Doing what God has called us to do. Doing yeah. what God what what, is, uh, what God has to, uh, to bring about mm -hmm. change and the moment we do that mm -hmm. is, he talked too much. He too radical. He yeah. too this. He too mm -hmm. that. They want you to just be so passive and allow everything to go on and, and continue to see mm -hmm. the people struggle. Continue to see the mm -hmm. people in bondage. Continue to see the people ca uh, captive. Mm -hmm. but, but 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 we have to, irregardless, when we are going through it, and even when we're being judged, always know that God is in control. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, and that's the that's the control you want to have. I that's expect problems. Yeah, but guess what? I already know that God is greater than any problem we want to face. Hallelujah. Amen. So verse 20, you kind of touch upon it. And brought them to the magistrate saying, These men being Jews do exceedingly trouble our city. Verse 21, And teach customs which are not lawful for us to receive, neither to observe being Romans. So how they, see how the lie and the schemery and the trickery come? Mm -hmm. So they bring them and say, these men are Jews. They're coming in and troubling our city. They're doing things that are not custom according yeah. to our. And mm -hmm. all they did was just yes, go so by the did. riverside, mm -hmm. going and pray to God, mm -hmm. of course, and uh, uh, um, uh, 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 took authority mm -hmm. and showed the evidence of the power of God, cast out a demon, set a girl free. And yet because of that, they caused trouble in the city. Mm -hmm. And how many times we are being accused about, mm -hmm. uh, 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 falsely accused, yeah. uh, about bringing trouble mm -hmm. when you're actually there 
to try to bring about a change. Amen. But when change comes, you're going to encounter problem. That's going to you're going to you're going to encounter problem. That is all part of mm -hmm. the process. But Amen. again, don't think it's strange concerning your fiery trial Hallelujah. and some strange thing to try you. Yes. Uh, uh, but you rejoice because you're partakers. Of Christ's suffering, that when His when you when His glory shall be revealed, you're mm -hmm. gonna be glad, exceedingly glad. So don't uh, 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 don't lose heart. Don't don't lose don't focus on in. what people yes. are saying or Amen. what people try to don't do. Don't be distracted. Keep the faith. <laughs> keep, keep the, the faith. faith and keep pressing. Keep working. Keep being purposeful. Keep seeking. Doing. Keep having that thirst. Thirst for knowledge. Thirst to really want to effect change and live in your purpose. Verse 21 and t no, no, verse 22. And the multitude rose up together against him. Mm. Look how the narrative changed. Look how he, he was uh, 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 really trying to cause a riot amongst them. Uh, and want... the magistrate rent off their clothes and commanded to beat them. Wow. My God, you want verse to... And when they had laid many stripes upon them, meaning beat them, they cast them into prison, charging the jailer to keep them safely. Who having received such a charge, thrust them into the inner prison and made their feet fast in the stocks. But here it is. Wait, not that one. That's okay, one okay. So I don't want to go there. there. Praise mm -hmm. the Lord. So so talking about problems. Yeah. Now Paul problems and his team, uh and Silas, uh -huh. along with uh yeah. Luke, uh they're they're, they're in prison now. Mm -hmm. In, uh, uh, they're <laughs> in prison simply for, 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 yeah. for, 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 for doing mm -hmm. the right uh, thing. what is right. Gospel. They done caused trouble in the yeah. city. And now they done rolled, they done, they done got multitude mm -hmm. of people. They just got a whole lot of people coming up against them, the magistrate, yeah. the religious uh -huh. uh, the religious leader, yeah. the, uh, all the, of the, the uh, governmental leader. Mm. They all, and they command them to take off their clothes. My I mean, God. they brought them to shame yeah. and humiliation, really of course. Yeah. Uh, they laid many stripes on them. Mm -hmm. They 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 broke. They they beat them. Mm -hmm. They were they, they literally was beaten, All because broken, doing the right thing. and bleeding. Yes. And now they put them in a prison. And while they're in a prison, uh, they got jailers mm -hmm. constantly watching mm -hmm. them twenty four hours. My God, they're watching them, yeah. of course. And so all of this, uh, 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 because Paul is doing. The will of God. Yeah, and so how do we God. how do we respond when mm -hmm. stuff like this happens? Mm -hmm. We gotta always know that, and this is what then we gotta the always know that ours. irregardless, mm -hmm. we cannot allow mm -hmm. our external circumstance mm -hmm. uh dictate mm -hmm. our internal come disposition. Come on, come on. Uh, uh, yeah. We can't allow mm -hmm. uh uh the pressure on the outside mm -hmm. determine how we're gonna uh, uh, respond mm -hmm. we, uh, to it instead of we ought not have a pity party, yeah. uh, but we ought to have a praise party. We ought to have we ought to be we ought to be a thermostat yeah. and not a thermometer, thermometer yeah. because a thermometer only regulates what's on the outside, mm -hmm. but a thermostat is being controlled mm -hmm. by what's on the inside. Mm -hmm. And even though they may they may they may they may do all what they can mm -hmm. on the outside. But they can't control what's to, on yeah. the inside. Yeah. And this is what Paul does, him and Silas, and that's where we're at in verse 25. You have to remain steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the works of the Lord for as much as you know. Your <laughs> labor, labor is not, is not in, vain. in vain. So no matter how much they may come against you, no matter how much it may seem, they may be winning in your eyes. You may see that they may be, mm. they may be triumphant over you because what? You're staying humble. You're staying the course. You stay in your ground. You keep in the faith in the midst of whatever adversity is coming to you when they're lying on you, when they're changing the narrative on you. When you know that uh, 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 they're just up to no good. They are just constantly plotting, plotting, plotting against you to do you harm, to do you to do you uh, wrong for Christ's sake. Hallelujah. You want to make sure when it's being done for Christ's sake, you got to stay in the course. You got to know that even in, when it may seem daunting, when it may seem dark, that God has your back. And God is going to show up in a way that is just going to blow their mind. This story is left on record For to reason. let us know, to encourage us that when we're, when we're going through our trials and tribulations, when we're being persecuted for Christ's sake, as long as we keep the faith and stand the course, God is going to show up and show out. Hallelujah. We just got to keep what? Praising, worshiping, praying. 
and 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 and, and celebrate what God is going to so, do. So so Paul is in trouble. He's Hallelujah. in trouble. Uh, why he's in trouble? They, he, they say he troubled the city. Uh -huh. He bought. Uh, yeah. uh, 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 he had bought this 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 gospel, this yeah. this, this, this false mm -hmm. gospel, causing folks to get delivered, causing folks yeah. to get free. Our business is is, is going to shut uh -huh. down All if we that. constantly lead, uh, mm -hmm. uh, if he constantly getting people free mm -hmm. and trusting God. So they said, you know what? We got to do whatever we can. Mm -hmm. And so they they beat him up. They dragged him. Yeah. He's broken. He's bleeding. My God, my God. And and and. and, and, and and he's just being battered. I mean, he's just all uh, uh, they're just tearing him up. He's mm -hmm. a he's a shame. But guess what? He's in trouble. But again, we call it John Lewis is good, good trouble. trouble. And when you're in good <laughs> trouble, then guess what? You can you can you can wipe the blood and, and even in the brokenness mm. and with everything in you, yeah. then you can get up at and you can get Come up on. instead of having a uh, having a, a pity, pity party, party. Have you can be in the store having a praise party. <laughs> because you already know that uh, the same God that take you to it oh, is going to yes. be the same God that's going to bring you through it. Hallelujah. So here it is, verse 25. And at midnight, at midnight, at midnight, Paul and Silas prayed and sang praise unto, unto God, and the prisoners heard them. Hallelujah. So, so what do you have? The dark of the night, the bright of the light. Come on. And so Paul <laughs> uh, uh, says uh, uh, that at, at midnight. midnight Paul and Silas, Silas and Paul, they they they, they got up. And could mm -hmm. you imagine them getting up at at, 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 at the dark of the the dark of the night is at the midnight. Mm -hmm. But yet at midnight there, there's there's a dawning between a new day. Come on. And so Paul didn't knew that. It. You know what? <laughs> God getting ready to do something yeah. new. And so instead of them uh, 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 complaining, Come because on. they had a lot. I mean, God, you sent us mm -hmm. over here. Mm -hmm. And if you sent us over here, we heard that yeah. it needed help. Yeah. And so now and uh, uh, Lydia opened mm -hmm. up her heart. Yes. Uh, of course, this woman whose name was not even mentioned, mm -hmm. she just got delivered. Mm -hmm. And now it I landed also, us yeah. mm -hmm. in the prison. Yeah. But yet, God, we still in your we will still. because we're doing your will. Yeah. We're doing the work. Mm -hmm. We're doing what you've assigned us Come to on. do. And so because I know what you called me to do, mm -hmm. and even though it's dark, yeah. and, and I, I do believe the I believe light is gonna come. come so at, at, at midnight, mm -hmm. the Bible said they got up yeah. and they did two things. Woo. They prayed yeah. and they sung and they praise, praise unto God. Yeah. Listen, when you pray, when, when you pray, you literally uh, uh you are you are invited to mm -hmm. go into the throne room yeah. of God. You are invited Come to on. go into the presence yes. of God. Is we it? go boldly to the throne yes. of God. God veil was open. Mm -hmm. Of course, uh, 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 and we're able to go. We don't have to wait for a priest. Mm -hmm. We don't have to wait for nobody else. We but we can, we can, we can go. And, we can go and talk to God yeah, ourselves. ourselves. And when we talk to God yeah. by faith, and we believe and mm -hmm. know that God heard us, then and, and after talking to God, mm -hmm. then we ought to begin to praise Come God. On. And we are not praise. <laughs> God, for the matter, uh, yes. uh, uh, we don't have to, we have to praise God after we see it. Yes. We ought to praise God in because we believe it, yes. because we already know that yes. uh, praise, He would inhabit the praise. Yes. So now it brings God on the Come scene. On. Mm -hmm. And when God is Come on the scene, on. Oh the Bible says, <laughs> and suddenly, suddenly. Why is this? Ah. at midnight, God, mm -hmm. uh, 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 wait, wait, at midnight, Paul is silent mm -hmm. prayer and some praise to God. Of course, the, G the, the Elohim God, the Creator God, the prisoner heard, they heard it. him. The prisoners, mm -hmm. all of them in prison heard them. But the most important thing is watch what God does in verse 26. And that lets you know they wasn't making no secret about their praying and their praise. Not it wasn't mumbling. They wasn't ashamed because uh. everybody heard them. And suddenly there was a great earthquake so that the foundations of the prison were shaken. And immediately all the doors were opened and everyone's bands were loose. Hallelujah. My so God, so, so God. look what happened. He goes to European <laughs> soil. He, 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 they, 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 they don't have a synagogue. Yeah. They don't have, they don't have, mm -hmm. they, because they didn't have 10 men, mm -hmm. 10 Jewish men. But yet, of uh, 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 these women who God touched in such a way, mm -hmm. one open her heart, yeah. heart and, and open her house, in her house one yeah. get delivered on. and get Paul <laughs> into the place <laughs> where there was men. Yeah. There, there, there was not enough men, but Come now on. all of a sudden, the reason why there was not, not enough men, mm -hmm. they were all in prison. prison. They were in bondage, in captivity. And so God says, I got to use Lord a woman to, yes. to get the man what? to where he literally needs yes. to get. I mean, I don't know you <laughs> 
And so he used this woman who gets delivered. Yes. And when the enemy really thought they were doing Paul wrong, they literally set Paul up My to be God. exactly where he needed to be. Oh, because it would be it here where Paul would on. give birth to the come church. On, on. It would be here where Paul would, you know, God, the Bible yes. says, suddenly. Uh, I mean, when, when, when you talk to God mm -hmm. and you begin to praise God, yes. listen, the prisoner heard, but God most importantly, the Bible says that suddenly, suddenly yes. God came in Ooh. and, and <laughs> and, and he shook the prison. The Bible says suddenly he shook, he shook the foundation of the yeah. prison and immediately doors were open mm -hmm. and Chains people were chain broken. were, uh, chain were broken. I'm telling you, some of us, there are some There's doors power. that have been closed yeah. in, in, in our face yeah. and some of us have been shackled yeah, uh, been uh, in sin. Mm -hmm. But God said, look what happened to Lydia, a woman of purple. Mm -hmm. Look what happened to the woman who had been possessed by, yeah. by a demon. Freedom. When he Loose. gets into that particular area, Freedom. God says, I'm about to shake up some things. Oh, and I don't know who that for tonight, oh, oh, but some oh. people need something to be shaken yeah. up in your life. Come some on. people, you 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 you, you have it. some doors that have yeah. been closed, Come but God on. says, I'm about to shake up some things, yeah. and immediately he says, Your your chain is gonna be broken. The chain is gonna be broken. Whatever has been holding you in bondage, yeah, whatever been it. holding you that's in captivity, it. he it. says, I am going to set you free. Ah, he's gonna lose the And I'm gonna do it when? Suddenly. Suddenly. Hallelujah. Suddenly. <laughs> Because of your faithfulness, I'm going to do it suddenly. Because of your steadfastness, I'm going to do it suddenly. Because you held your, your, your feet to the plow, I'm going to do it suddenly. suddenly. Because you showed your faithfulness. God is faithful. So, so what happened? Uh -huh. I want you to go back. Mm -hmm. The Bible says God heard him, <laughs> but the prisoner heard him. See, you got to be in a place <laughs> where you got to hear can't be ashamed. So, because if you yes. don't hear it, you're going to miss it. Oh. You know, you're going to miss the move of God. Mm -hmm. And so, therefore, you need to wake up and hear the word of God. Yes, they're praying it. and they're singing praise mm -hmm. to God. And they hear the movement of yes. God. And their chains were broken. Come on. The doors were open, open and they were set free. They were set free. Hallelujah. But here it goes. <laughs> and the keeper of the prison awaking uh -oh. out of his sleep and seeing the prison doors Go open, ahead. I'm more he drew you. out his sword and would have killed himself, supposing that the prisoners had been fled. Go, keep God, keep God, going. God, mm -hmm. Look how God was just, ooh, shake up things all around. No, no, why? Keep going. But verse Paul three. cried with a loud voice saying, do thyself no harm. For we are all here. So, so quickly, when uh, when whenever a uh, uh, a Roman, he's 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 over there. He, he's he's a prison guard, mm -hmm. and of course, his his job is to protect, yes. make sure he keep these individuals uh -huh. uh, 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 um, locked down. Mm -hmm. And if they would get free on his watch, he, he they would kill him. Yes. And so, in his yes, mind, said, "Guess what? Yes. I would rather kill myself." Yes. And and so, yes. these people treated Paul them bad. Oh, they 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 God. drag him through uh, the city. They beat him up. Yeah. They broke him up. They were bleeding. Yeah. But notice, and they Paul, put him in the inner part and, of the And they put him in the worst part yes. of the prison. My in other God. words, like Christ on the cross. On. He's at the middle. Yeah. That's the worst, of Ooh. course. They're saying he's the worst Ooh. of the worst. Yeah. They put him in with the worst of the worst. Yeah. But yet, look what happened. Mm -hmm. This man would have killed himself, but what mm -hmm. Paul did... Paul said, hold up. And, the name and that's Jesus. when you know that you're filled with the Holy Spirit, <laughs> yeah. that even the folks who treat you wrong, you're going to try to save them. What? You, 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 you miss, don't, don't miss yes, it. I'm a, I'm a, and stop holding the grudge. Come on. Stop carrying this oh, pain. No. Uh -uh. You Be bless free. them. Yeah, bless you them. love your enemy. Bless, bless them that yes. curse you. Do yes. good to the haters. Yes. And pray for them that despitefully misuse you. It. Paul that's said, it. don't do yourself yes. no harm. Stop. In the name of Jesus. Now, y'all know what y'all to say. Huh. <laughs> vengeance is mine. Yes. The Lord. Yes. Y all, y all, instead of trying to help them, y'all that, huh, vengeance is mine. The Lord repay. You should hurt. He, he, he killed his own. Said, no. Mm -hmm. Paul said, hold up. Don't do your. That's the attitude. Attitude and mindset we have to have because guess what the whole thing is we want to see all yes, men be saved even yes. the worst of the our worst. enemies hallelujah hallelujah because we have to have a christ-like spirit <laughs> and attitude hallelujah it is God desired. It is not God's. It's God desired that nobody perish. But all come to repentance Hallelujah. and be saved. Hallelujah. He's a long suffering God. Yes, He's a forgiving God. He's a loving God, and that's what we have to exude. Not that it's easy. Especially when you're dealing with difficult people, especially when you're dealing with folks that came at you every which way. Pray for me. It's not always easy to really what show that love and concern in return. But through Christ, we can do all, all things. things. 
And we can. And we gotta know that we gotta know that we have to uh, uh, abide by that. That in Christ we can do all, all things. things. And even even in that, mm -hmm. Paul says, "Don't do yourself." Yeah. I know most of y'all, Sister Juanita Perlman. You probably say, "Oh no, huh? <laughs> you don't you don't you don't drag me. Yeah. You don't you, done, you done done beat me. Above me. I'm bleeding you and I'm broken. And, and, and huh? You, you done I'm not gonna try to help me. No, no, me. We, we can't do that, Sister Pearl. God. God has called us to be Christian. Yes. We are Christ. We're Christ -like. Like. Think about it. All those who the, uh, uh, what they did with Christ at Calvary mm -hmm. Cross, and the first thing Christ would say, Father, I'm them. not represented yeah. them. And in the court of law, mm -hmm. they, they, they have been, mm -hmm. they, they, they're wrong, they've they sinned, come short of law. Yeah. But God, but, guess what? Do me a favor, God. Uh, uh, forgive them. Mm -hmm. They don't know. They don't even know what they're mm -hmm. doing. They man, what amazing know. God. He's mm -hmm. a lawyer who never lost yeah. a case. And God wants us to represent him. Come on. We are an ambassador and we don't want to lose one soul, mm -hmm. even if those who hurt us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Show mercy. Give mercy. Just as God gives to us. Us mercy. Praise the Lord. And so 28, but Paul, no, no, 29. Then he called for a light and sprang in and came trembling and fell down before Paul and Silas. Keep going, go ahead on, go ahead on. And brought them out and said, sirs, what must I do to be saved? Verse 31, keep going. 31, and they said, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ and thou shalt be saved and Thy house. Verse 32. Look, whoa, at, whoa. Look, look how that was. And they speak unto him the word of the Lord and to all that were in his house. And he took them the same hour of the night and washed their stripes and was baptized. He and all his straightway. So I just want you to see it's just a whole lot. My up, God, up my there. God. Uh, uh, he's springing this still dog. Mm -hmm. Act for light. He mm -hmm. acting for he, he acting for light, mm -hmm. and he's trembling. He's in fear, yeah. uh, uh, worship falling before Paul and Silas, mm -hmm. and, and 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 the thing is, sir, yeah. what must I do to be saved? <laughs> I want, man, you got a God that God you on. got a God that answering at midnight. <laughs> You got a God that will shake some stuff in my life. You got a God that will take chains off and open doors. Who my wouldn't God. want to serve a God like that? Huh. And so he says, God, what must I do uh, uh, to be saved? And he says, mm. Jesus, Paul says, believe the Lord yeah. and thy shall be saved. Not only you going to be saved, mm -hmm. but your household salvation. I, we, listen, Hallelujah. Paul said, Paul, Paul, Paul wasn't just interested in a man, no. but he said he wants he want his whole household his whole house. saved. And that's what we, we got to, we got to, but we done, we done got away from yeah. what 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 ambassadors and representative mm -hmm. of Christ is all yeah. about, and we done got so caught up with with cars, career, cash, and, mm -hmm. and credit card, and 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 we done we done we done forgot it about it's about yeah. it's about going winning souls. The winning Bible souls says the Christ. fruit of righteousness yeah. is tree of life, yeah. and he who wins soul is wise. Yeah. Paul shows that he is wise mm -hmm. because he's out winning souls, mm -hmm. and that's what we ought to be about. Mm -hmm. Winning, not an argument, yeah. but winning souls. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Don't get it misconstrued. Don't, 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 don't get it twisted. We are purposeful here to be about winning souls for Christ by any means necessary. Will that always come easy? No. Will we always be on part in doing it as we on this, 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 this journey to navigate this Christian terrain? No. But we know that we can't do it of our own. We have to fully rely on God. That's what we got out oh. here. We leap in it. Fully rely on God to execute whatever assignment He has He has uh, commissioned us on. And know that even in an assignment, it's not going to always be peaches and cream. We go, we're not exempt from running into situations and problems because that's when sin is really all in. He's going to pounce every which way. To be about getting you off track, to derail your 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 journey, your commission, uh, your assignment. But that's when we have to be fully entrusted into the Word of God, into prayer, to make sure that as we are on this journey to effecting change, to really executing our assignments, we are doing our part to stay rooted and grounded in the Word of God. No matter what may come out, what resistance may come our way, what 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 uh, issues we may face, what challenges we may go through, we have to be uh, steadfast, unmovable, always abounding. abounding in the works of the Lord. And don't be weary. Because our labor 
It's not in vain. Hallelujah. Don't be weary in well-doing. Well doing. You're going to Take read. Take time. Even if you're going, even if, if it may look out. dark, it, yes. may, it may look like, wait a minute, don't, but if you keep, if you stay the course, you will reap. Stay the course. If you yes. do not lose heart. Amen. God bless y'all. Expect problem, yes. but always know that in the midst of the problem, mm -hmm. always stand on God's purpose. Hallelujah. And God is going to fulfill that which he has already purpose in you. Amen, amen. The essentials for changing the world. We want to make sure we're doing our part to effect change, to be world changers. And that starts with us. We got to get things right with us before we can be any good to others. And in doing so, we got to fully rely, rely on God. God. Frog. frog it. F-R-O-G. Fully, fully rely, rely on, on God. God. And of course, it's on this day that we're leaping, leaping into March Madness. Come on. Gladness. March Gladness. Fully rely on, on God. God. We'll march gladness. Mm. God bless y'all. Pray all as well. Amen. That even if you might be having a, a, a hard and difficult time, listen, get up at midnight. I'm yeah. telling you, I want you pray. to get up tonight pray and get up at midnight <laughs> and talk, talk to God yes. and begin to praise God and watch how God suddenly begin to move on your behalf. Amen. He's going to suddenly uh, begin to cause some foundational things to, yes. to be shaken. Amen. And of course, uh, doors going to be open and chains are going to fall. Hallelujah. Uh, God is going to move in such a way that the things that have been holding you down and holding you captive, God is about to bring your release and your deliverance. Trust Hallelujah. God and watch how God move on your behalf. Expect problem, but mm -hmm. always know that you have a problem solver. Hallelujah. That God. That's God. That's God. He's the he's 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 the, the 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 supreme problem solver, and so that's what we got to keep our faith and trust in. We hope again you all have been blessed with yet another poignant, relevant message. We know we're a little over time, but we mm -hmm. thank you for just hanging in there with us. Because here again, it's about us growing and evolving together. And since we are on this journey to changing the world, we want to make sure we get in as much nuggets. As, as we can to help can. us navigate this terrain of life. Uh any, anything else before Praise the Lord. Of course, I hope all is well. We have Sunday school. Yeah. Beautiful Sunday school. We're going in a lesson of Jude. Jude is going to teach us mm -hmm. uh, a lesson on how uh, all false people have come in and infiltrate the church. And of yeah. course, how we should be building up mm -hmm. on the most holy faith. And he gives a benediction. And it's amazing uh, that I just was studying that and just how uh, uh, the scoffers and all of those were coming in. Uh, trying to dilute uh, uh, the word of God. And so, uh, again, we want to encourage parents, encourage our children. Please get on. We need to make sure that we're teaching. We got to make sure that we're building ourselves up so that uh, uh, the enemy do come, that we are able to lift up a standard. The enemy do come, that we can continue to walk in the victory that Christ has given us. And then on Sunday, we have Black History mm -hmm. 365. It yeah. is it yeah. is March Gladness. Yeah. March Gladness. We're going to be celebrating the li a living legend, yes. of course. And the message on uh, Sunday is going to be very simple, uh, but there's so much to thank God for. Mm -hmm. So amen, much to amen. thank God for. And so many reasons to thank God. Yeah. And of course, we want to continue to be in prayer for all of our bereaved families, namely the Landex family as they're preparing to lay their loved to one, lay their loved one uh, to rest. And so many other families, the tragedy that happened uh, in the community, we're praying for those families. Pray, um, so, yeah, pray for that the family. The tragedy uh, yeah. there. And of course, we just want to give a shout out to Sis Sharon Nicholas, who underwent a, 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 a major surgery, a major, major surgery, surgery just a few days ago. And here it is. She is being purposeful, intentional to really be about uh, uh, feasting on God's word to be on the live on tonight. We bid you greetings to Sharon and, and continue blessings for your recovery and your healing and to any and all who may be going through uh situations in life dealing with uh problems and and, and challenges and or just uh, whatever it is you're standing in need of we're touching an agreement with you as you have gathered with us tonight on this prayer uh, on this uh bible study Praise the Lord. and so we do have a fly out for our march gladness uh uh, uh lineup 
Uh, one day I want y'all to mark, because we're not going to have Bible class at home. That's March 27th. Mm -hmm. We're going to have Holy Thursday. We have all seven our ministers and preachers together, our young people again. Mm -hmm. And I'm excited about that. And we are literally starting with them early. I want y'all to go out and, and share with others. We're going to have a great time. Yes. We're planning on having a great time on Amen. March 27th. We're going to feed you with the Word of God. And then we're going to feed you. We're going to feed you. We're going <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna to give you a little something to eat yeah. to go. But we want to just make sure that we come in fellowship and support and encourage our young men. Amen, amen, amen. Again, we're looking forward to it. We are leaping into Matter March fact, gladness. It's, it's going to be so, March so powerful. We're going to have yeah. a mass choir. We want everybody that's part of the choir to be up there and we're going, we're going back to Calvary. Mm -hmm. We're going back to Calvary song, so we're planning on making it uh, uh, certainly relevant as they take us back to the seven last word of the cross. Let us pray. God, our Father, we love and honor you. We give you glory and praise for this wonderful day. God, we thank you again for this lesson, God. Oh, we thank yeah. you, dear God, thank for those, you, dear God, who were here. Uh, dear God, we pray, dear God, that the Spirit of God would illuminate, Lord God, it would truly open up our eyes, that it would truly bring about revelation, Lord God, that even the problem and the situation that we may have faced, Lord God, dear God, that many may have questioned themselves and even questioned you, Lord God, but we know, dear God, that you, Lord God, oh, allow certain yes, things to happen, Lord. Lord God, to get us into the place and to, to their alignment and for the assignment that you have given unto us. So, Father, we pray even now, Lord God, that we will respond the way the Apostle Paul and Silas responded, Lord God, instead of us having a pity party. God, we pray that we would begin to, to pray, Lord oh, God, to yes, make supplication unto you, Lord God, Lord. and to praise. That is to sing Zion song, Lord God, because we already know, Lord God, that when we pray, God, you allow us to go into your presence, but yes. when we praise God, you Thank come you, into Lord. our presence, because we know, God, when praise go up, blessing Lord God, we believe down. blessing will come down, and I believe tonight, Lord God, that somebody's praising you yes. even now, yes. somebody praising you, Lord God, because even in the midst of their Thank pain, Lord God, they believe, Lord God, that you are going to ease it, even in the midst yes, of confusion, God. we yes. believe you're going to send peace, even in the midst of sickness, Lord God, Hallelujah. you're bringing healing and deliverance, even in the midst of financial even difficulties, Lord, Lord God, we believe that you are supplying all yes. of that need. Lord God, even in the midst of confusion, we believe, God, you're bringing peace. In the midst of our weakness, God, you're bringing strength. Hallelujah. We thank you for it, Jesus. Lord God. We believe you for it. And God, we believe you're going to do it suddenly. suddenly. God, we thank you again for every family yes. that represented yes. tonight. We plead the blood of yes, Jesus Lord. over every family, Lord God. Now, God, as we leave tonight from this, Lord God, Hallelujah. platform Jesus. that you've allotted us to have, Lord yes. God. 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 We know yes. we are never ever leave yes. your presence Hallelujah. because you are an omnipresent God and you promise to be with us always, uh, even until the end of the world. So God, we pray that you will send the angels, Please send them Lord. on a divine yes, assignment, God. Lord God, yes. that they will bless us and keep us, Lord God, that Lord God, your hands will be upon us and that you yes, will be gracious God. unto yes. us. Lord God, lift up the countenance upon us and give us peace. Hallelujah. The peace of God that passes all, all understanding. understanding. God, will you keep our heart and mind through Christ Jesus? Jesus. But this is your servant prayer. We believe, we receive it, and we know it's done. It is in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit we pray. Amen. 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 Again, we hope you've been blessed. Let's continue to do our work to be to effect change, to be on this uh change in the world journey. Do your part, do your own your own individual part so that we can collectively be about doing it in a in a greater uh in a greater way for god's purpose y'all be blessed love you all peace Yay. hallelujah frog Has fully rely on oh god we are leaping into much gladness hallelujah Y'all be blessed, be blessed, be blessed. Did you see the heart speed? The big heart came out again? I missed it, I missed it. Let me try that again. In my hand, it should have a heart come through it. Let's go, where's that? Where's Look. that? Oh, okay, okay, so you're doing it. Okay, I'm doing that? You better, Evidently. You, you better see? watch me. Wow. Hallelujah. I'm, I'm just so <laughs> creative. You see if it does it with me. You gotta, it's, it's, it's something you gotta do, Ray. Let me show you how to do it. Right oh, there, there it goes. Oh. That is awesome. <laughs> y'all be blessed. Love uh, you all. Wow. I'm blowing y'all some big hearts. So 
so we're able to kind of effect some hearts to them as well. Hallelujah. Love God you bless y'all. Y'all have a great night. Let's do it together, man. Let's see. Okay. Double, double trouble. Good trouble. Well, yeah, babe, I'm waiting on you. I'm waiting on you. What's wrong? <laughs> What's going on? What's going on with you? That's okay. You're doing it for me. Okay, I'm going to let you go. Go get you no, some. Get you some. Go ahead. Get you some. Do you something. You're good. Throw me one. Hallelujah. Y'all be blessed.